Hey everybody, it's Sean Tagnus the Big Fit Balloon, back with some more Animal Crossing. Last time, I April fooled you guys. Probably. I don't know, I don't know how successful it's going to be, but I only decided to do an April Fool's episode when I realised, oh wait, 106 is going to be uploaded that day. Ah, I could do something evil. When I realised it, yeah, still. Well, I'm just getting rambly, but yeah. I also decided to do an episode of Kirby Streamland if I have that planned right, so I hope you enjoyed it as well. So, but apologies for fooling you twice, but I never really had an opportunity to do an April Fool's joke. I honestly, with, well, I was already nine, or eight, but yeah. Yeah, I never really had an opportunity to do an April Fool's joke because I don't really like doing them, especially since I don't really like, you know, harming people and stuff. I don't like that. But either way, it's nice to actually do one for once and just have some fun with it. I hope you enjoyed it and stuff. But for right now... Okay, what have we got? Okay. Alright, I need to check, but... What did we get? We got from Gladys. Red. HRA. We did it. We did it! Beer for your room gets one... 150,820 points. Unbelievable! Please, t please take this gift to come rate earning 150,000 points. We did it. We have finally gotten the max stuff for our house. We need. We have completed the house tasks now. And the only one we need to get now is the platinum points. And the town hall. And the museum. Well, let's not worry about that right now. Okay, I think starting off, I'm just going to do a quick grab all the photos and stuff to make sure they're all stored away and stuff. But still, I kept the Imperial stuff just because I thought it would make a good combo just in case we need to get our score a bit higher. But okay, let's put it back on the Cabana table. I had to, yeah, I had to take that out just because it was filling up and stuff. Especially since I had to place my Lucky Clover down as well. So I get Cabana table place. And oh, man. We'll be able to reorganize this room now. We could do anything with our house again. We don't have to worry about getting high scores. We're done. We're done with this. We can be happy now. Okay. Back you go. Back you go. I also might just sell these, I think, because I don't really have any use for them. I don't think I want to use them for any specific room house theme, sadly. I think we've already got our big theme, so we got one more. We've got to update our snow theme now, because we don't need them anymore. We can just store them away. Alright, let's grab our photos and stuff. Okay, we're gonna grab our. Yeah, put green photos, so that should be J. At Sweckles, which we need to get our birthday present today, so we'll get that done. And we've got Pascal. Yeah, make sure to put the green photos here just for a nice green theme. Okay, and then we've got the modern room. But yeah. Honestly, I had to pre plan the whole moving my house stuff just so for the April Fool's joke, so I actually had to pre plan that. But most of the other stuff was actually done on day off, like the Kirby drawings, the King Dedede drawing for the middle. That was basically the all planned. The only other thing I had pre-planned was just buying all the wigs and stuff, which were hidden in my tools area. So if you're wondering where it was, it was there. But all right, we can also get rid of Lucky Clovers as well. We could keep them stored up as well now. We don't have to worry about using them for Lucky Scores as well, so that'll be good. Okay, should have a couple of pictures in here. Yeah, but put the yellow ones here because I thought that would fit with Wing Tree just in case. If I have that. Okay, we're full and stuff. So I think that was Tom Nick's last one I got. No, it was Bill's. Okay, where's Bill's? My... Yeah, there we go. Bill the Psychopath. Okay, Jay's, I think. Well. I don't think it really matters too much, but I don't think I have the second J one here. Okay, and I know which one Pascal goes into here. Yuka, Drake, Gladys, I think we just sort of get guys that's just in front of us, so let's grab that. Oh yeah, alright. I don't know, I should just, well we only got one more to grab quickly, so let's just get that done quickly. It won't take too long, I don't think. Alright. We got to get 
Freckles picture. We also got to go to the reef because they have a point sale going on. It didn't happen yesterday, but hopefully I'll explain in one of my edits I'll need to do is that funny enough that the fact that you can't you can't actually have point sales unless you have two different characters on the on your save file. We learned a lot about that. There's also stuff like you can't buy anything as I've probably said in the video. But you can't have you can't get spotlight products, you can't get half sales without all that. Which I just find weird, but oh well. You probably want more villagers, just so now you can just have, you know, you could do more tile sets and stuff and all that. Okay, I think for right now though, I'm gonna head to town hall, reorganize my mail and stuff, and then I'll see you in a sec. Oops, I forgot to gr get to grab the Tom Nook picture. There we go. Now we'll meet you at town hall. Oh! Huh! Oh, Bob, it seems my daughter's run off again. What a naughty kitten. I wonder if she's headed off to the reef. Oh, no. Is she going to take over Red because she he's going to be there? Please, no. I don't need her uh, taking over my Red spot. Oh, well, if we can get the cat to the reef, we can hopefully do it. It would be nice to get it done on the Sunday, but okay. Alright, how are you doing, Pelly? You'll probably be gone about an hour or two. Yeah, you leave at 10 p.m., so. Yeah. Whee! Screen glitch! I really don't know how that happens, but okay. Do do. One goes there. This is just. Yeah. Which one do I have Tom look at? Yeah, Lyle. Now we could just put them in the categories. That's Drake, so I should really wait. Yeah, because G is over here, because he has two down, so. Boop. Boop. Bill, where's Bill? Yay for bad memory. Last one. But wait, where's Butcher's Lair anyway? I thought I would have put Butcher's Lair somewhere safe. Oh, here. Okay, and then Pinky should be here, which we need to grab because because we don't have our letters normally. Well, not. You know what I mean? I haven't got the letters in my inventory. So that's Freckles, Freckles, not that. There, no. Last one again. Even I can keep making mistakes. Okay, Yuka. Why do I keep doing this? All right, Drake, you can only be here because you're still guys and guys this is here. We're all done. Oh, he said we're all done. Okay, done. All right, and then you'll save our letters. Well, thank you for doing all that, Pelly. Okay, and then we can just store our other two pictures and stuff. And I'm wasting a lot of time on this high. <laughs> but, yeah, but I'll just store our pictures quickly. And yeah, we'll keep them there forever, probably. Unless I really want them to use them for, you know, decorations. But I think we're all done with them. It was very nice to get use them as a huge point booster. Okay. Uh, right, let's save a letter. And then we can get our items out so we can actually do stuff. <laughs> Like a fossil hunt as usual. But yeah, and then we can put butchered here. Now we just grab all the items. HRA, HRA, the star. Wait, did I get it wrong? No, I don't think so. Pinky, red. Yeah, there we go. Thank you very much, Belly. Alright, man. We've been getting so many goals lately, even if it isn't really something like that takes up an episode time. Yes, we've been good that we've been completing goals. Alright. Wow, this even take a while, but yeah, that's all. Thanks. Okay, let's see. Have we got anything in here right now? There we do. Sandbag and telescope. So that'll be Butch, because he got his fossil, and the sandbag is from Bill. Yeah, okay. Well, let's head out for now. Well, first off, I should get... You know what? I'll wear this haircut until we head to Tom Nook's. Or would it be funny to keep this up? But yeah, let's get some fossil hunting done. Oh, there's our first fossil. Ta-da! But alright, we also need to do some watering later, but we'll wait for that now. It also seems like the trees are actually getting greener now. You can actually tell a lot. <laughs> Which is very nice, honestly. It looks very nice. I can name any rock there, but still. Well, it is going end of winter, so hopefully things get right. 
All right, I forgot to collect this. Also, I think it's kind of funny just to leave it as a joke, just because then it's just like, oh, look, I forgot the money. I don't even take it like usual. All right, we need to collect that now, though. <laughs> there, yay, money picking up. Also, this is normally a section I would actually cut out of the picture because it just takes too long when you're just recording it and stuff. It's just like, you have to watch me do all this picking up like this, and then boom, boom, and you gotta do this, gotta do this. I like even full of inventory down now. Can you transfer that to all, please? Thank you. There we go. There. But yeah, it just takes up too much time in an episode. And my episodes last like 40, 50 minutes sometimes. But I just find it ridiculous. Although I should technically, you know, cut it down a bit, but yeah. How are you doing, Freckles, otherwise? Bee Monkey, is that you? What are you doing up this late? Tell me, fine, I hope. I ate coconut custard all day every night, I decided to garden, but it didn't help. I was just so lonely until you showed up. Oh, so you want something from we are? Yay! Give me news. Hey, what do you think? What do you do when you find something that someone lost? Forget it. Why was just wrong, yay? You can't take lots of stuff to go home, Bucker. That's what I do. Yeah, you do indeed. Are you excited for your birthday? Yeah, I'm just so excited. I'm so excited. What am I going to get? Right? Right? Yeah, I love chatting. So, what's it for me? I want story time. I don't know, so I became a member of the HRA, but trying to wait for school. Me, I'm like a complete decorating dupe. Well, we're going to see how totally awesome I am, yay. Well, well, Freckles, I just got the HRA award. Oh, really? Man, I wish I could get that. Yeah, I got the 150,000 points. Well, I must take a lot of hard work. I wish I could do that. Don't. You have done enough, Freckles. Do not listen to their ways. I will not be listening to their ways for any more. I'm free from their shackles. They hold no power over me now. And really? Yes. So be free, Freckles. You do not have to burden the sin. Okay. Yay. I won't worry about them unless I talk about it. Indeed. Okay, we've got two more fossils to find. So let's get that done. Oh, that's the second fossil, unless I was, yeah, for a second I thought that'd be trap. Oh, we got dry roads down then today. Well, hopefully they're not too hidden, otherwise it's going to be a pain to hunt them down. But she said I want to keep this like a short episode. Wait, is that? No, you got a trick by the corner. But I want to keep this a short episode today. Don't want to do anything too long, honestly. Oh, uh, yeah. Also, I have been actually thinking about, hey, do I actually really, really want to try and understand this game? My mind's going through, should I grind for it? Should I do it? Should I do this for even longer? Not, I think I have an end date for when I want to do end let's play, but I still want to probably keep playing it and maybe I'll just do a random episode after I've done everything, like a 100% episode or something like that. But still, I was just calculating stuff like, how long would it get take me to get the 999 billion bells for the bank? And if it was lucky, like if I got like, say like 400 million bells prof every day, not day, every week, it would take me about five, three weeks. We're just calculating, I don't know. I was just trying to calculate on top of my head, like if I sold about 10 million bells of turnips and then turned that into 40 million bells, Oh, was that it? I can't remember the specific calculations, but I was just calculating all that and I was just like, it would take a while. Are you good? How are you doing? Oh jeez, how to get me 8 or 5, 15 already? I'm saving you may finally be able to walk around together. So what to bug, bug me about this time? Are you doing good? I'm doing good. Why would you ask that? Oh nothing, I just thought an alternate universe would have, you know, made you scary. What do you mean by that? But want to test your luck and brains with a little trivia? Bring it. That's the spirit. Alrighty then. Imagine there's a red card and a white card here. I'm gonna ask you a question when you pick up the right answer. Here's the first question. Your mom's yelling at your dad and his face turns red. Ah, that is correct. And now on the question number two talks about. A stern gentleman in his 40s is standing by a fountain in the mall. What called the is this wearing on his hat? White. I gotta say, I'm impressed. Get ready for your last question. Ready? This is the one I messed up on. Here it is. What color are the men long johns? Why? But it's a trick question. I know bad, too bad. Mavs Long Johns are in fact pink, Toxica. In this case, the correct response would have been to pick both cards. I thought there would have been a way to win that, but I guess not. <laughs> it's just the one that you just have fun with the conversations. 
But yeah, I was actually w watching a few retrospectives on Animal Crossing Wild World. It was actually pretty interesting. Oh, hi Gladys. What do you want to talk about? Testing one, two. I know how you love me, so here it comes. Pop quiz time, big monkey. Well, you just heard Yuka doing a pop quiz, now you want to do it. How would you describe my relationship with Yuka? Oh, like that. Well, be monkey, you know us so well. Well, like you said, there's nothing wrong with the two of us right now. Of course, I suppose things could be a little better, couldn't they? But that's another story. For guessing right, I got a special treat for you. What is that? Another rug? Wool? Oh, flooring. What? Oh, you want something else, Stretch? Yeah, sorry. Don't worry. It's actually funny. Aren't you? Are you actually two actually, you know, into quizzes and stuff? And now you've been talking together. Hey, Yuka, which one phrase describes you best and why, Stretch? What a weird question. Hmm, let me think. I've got it. Every rose has a thorn. That's perfect for me. After all, I'm beauty, but I'm also deadly. That's great, but um, roses aren't deadly. I am now. I mean, yeah, they got thorns, but those just hurt. They're not deadly. Do you not know the Pokemon Roserade? Roserade. Oh, really? Not even poison roses? I don't even know why I'm bothering asking you questions like that, Yuka. I don't even understand Pokemon. Yeah. But still, it's funny how long I've actually been able to turn that gag of Yuka being a poison master and stuff. It just might be like a Pokemon Rose Raid and stuff. But wow. Okay. Well, let me just click this muddy off screen because otherwise I'm just going to be picking up one by one every time. Okay, are you triple fossil? Okay, you're a uh, gyroid! And now my inventory's full. Okay, let me put these gyroids down. But yeah, as I was seeing before the quiz stuff happened, I did watch a few retrospectives, and it was interesting seeing how people praised Wild World for its dialogue and stuff. Which I'm curious about the dialogue in other games and stuff. Like, I don't know what the dialogue is for Sea Folk and original Animal Crossing, but I hope it's as good and fun as this, even if it's just a little bit. Because I would love to see more dialogue that's just this comedic. I know the series... Wow, fell in trap. But I know the series has its later faults, but it's just like... You don't really get many good interactions between villagers and stuff. But I don't remember having still having a good time. But I would love to see them keep, keep this up. Because I think having fun dynamics where you can have a rough villager or a villager that is very cute and stuff. I think you need a mixture, honestly. And I think that's what this game brings. It's one of those good pros and stuff, even if it is limited in other areas. But still. Yeah, it's been just fun playing through all these games and stuff, and I hope I can continue with that. Well, I hope I can continue Animal Crossing series at some point, but I think once I'm done with this, it will probably be a long break where I just take a nice break from Animal Crossing, because what is nice playing this, it can also just be tiring recording this day in and day out. We'd have said previously, but yeah. Okay, uh, okay, that's the last gyroid, I think, because we already dug the trap, so yay! We got all that done. Okay, for right now, we'll get our fossils examined and then I'll head to brew. And yeah, then we'll show off all our items that we got, and then we'll probably just sell. We'll head to Tom Nook to sell items and stuff. So yeah, now we can do all the other stuff we need to do. Like visit Able Sisters, head to the reef, talk to people here in their houses, and all that jazz. Oh yeah, I think we haven't talked to one person outside as well, so I gotta do that as well. It's kind of weird to think about it, but I don't actually ever have to show fossil hunting ever again now. Not fossil hunting, but you know, showing off what fossils we've got, because We've already completed the fossil collection here. We've already completed Damien's actual collection. And the only thing right now is the Reef's fossil collection, which I'm just only doing so now we don't have to ever check fossils again. So yeah, we at this point, we only need to... Well, we don't even need to check them. We'll, we'll probably just do a Reef off screen and yeah, it'll probably all work out. But how are you doing, Brew? Careful, couple Java to pick you up. It's 200 bells. What blend do you the usual. Cool. What's a special house plan today? But it turned out a little differently. Ah, it's very nice to hang out as usual, Brew. But I forgot pink hair. I was doing April Fool's joke, but you probably didn't remember because I wasn't canon. <laughs> ah, yes. 
flavor. Very good. At the perfect temperature, bring out the flavor. 176 degrees. Refreshly brewed cup. Drink cup. Thanks, I will. Yum, yum. Mmm. Ah. Rich room and a bold taste that penetrates my very soul. Yum. Uh, thank you very much, Brew, for the drink. Oh, well, actually, Gavin, Brew has less dialogue in other games, apparently. It just makes me sad. Like, Brew should have hundreds of lines of dialogue just so you could never meet the end of it. It'd be perfect. But I spent my college days in a cafe like this one, but soon I won't be able to talk as much about that. I know. But still, I will always enjoy your t time and company, Brew. Well, thank you very much. But I'm going to head to Tom next quickly. As we need to sell items and stuff, because otherwise we can't show off the items in the house. Oh, I was awfully sorry. I was... Well, never mind. What can I do for you? Talk to me for I sell stuff. My point is, BFB, this town is laid back and easy to live in. I hardly doubt that. When everyone doesn't doubt it, can't upgrade their houses. Life in the city is completely different. It's a scary place, yes? I have heard horror stories about... I've heard one of the game mechanics was about... I didn't even know about it was the fact that if you walk on grass there, the path deteriorates and the grass goes away and it's just like, what? And I can ruin how towns look, which makes me worry about what I do decide if I play that game. This place, well, unless you have money, no one will give you the time of day. Just as they say, huh? A concrete jungle. Really? Yes, yes, really, assuredly. Take the big, big city banks, for example. If I were to die a young man, alone, Though they know nothing of his character. I'm smarter now, yes? I know that you must take the branch manager out. <laughs> oh my god, did you assassinate him? You must rule his financial instincts if you are to get him on your side, hmm? Yes, yes, sadly I lacked that knowledge when I was young, naive raccoon. In fact, I got so upset I went on a tirade to end all tirades, hmm? And the rest is history, yes, yes, sad history. Back then I was so very ignorant, hmm? But such is the price of the passion of youth. Wow. So you're just a broken man that just wants to torture people. Of course I am. But yeah, I just need to sell some stuff, so... Goodbye Imperial stuff. I need room in my stuff. Room, no, room, room in my closet. Just so now I can actually put new stuff in. I need old flooring, and that's bad. I wonder if anyone's sick today so I can actually give out the medicine. Okay, for right now, let's see. 1,460.10. Yep, I'll do that. Thank you very much. No, that's all. We need to check turnip prices because we're going to buy turnips today. Let's see. Let's head upstairs and then we'll get a haircut once we report what we need. What's items here today, though? Okay, this is the second floor. Here, if I purchase for other items around your house, house. I don't think there's any spotlight products because I take the bullet board. I mean, yep, there's nothing new here today, so. Yep. Oh, look at this. It's the classic sofa. Probably the first time we could have bought the classic sofa, I think. Apart from Booker getting classic two in his inventory and all that stuff. Oh no, this round at me again. We just went a hug. Oh, that's very good. Nothing menacing then. Well, right, we need to get a haircut now, so thank you very much. Please see us again soon, soon. Alright. Hey there, sugar. Welcome to the Shampoodle. Alright, well, let's get our haircuts and hopefully get something good. Well, we want to get my original haircut back. Shh, you don't have to say, I know what you're thinking. Oh. Really, Sugar? Well, I know how hard you can be let go of a favourite style. No, I... Fun enough, I did this, this whole hairstyle random apart from the colour because I wanted to do link it to Kirby, but... Yeah, I'm surprised I actually got the same haircut that I got from the haircut episode. How about the shampoo and shop in Cal for the three thousand bells? Yep, we just need to get our hair back in nice. So let's get that done quickly. Alrighty then. I'll need to take these hands before you get started. Well, and sugar, in order to give you a style that reflects you, I can ask you a few questions first, and that'll be why you really come alive. Every day is great at your June as. You definitely strike out as Dorothy say. Do you like the sun? How warm does it make you how does it make you feel? Warm, painful, doomed, despair. I have one more question to ask. If you're rushing to get the sound, I just want to call you, what would you do? Hmm, what would I do? I would ignore them. How could they? I see grooming is very important, so I can't say I can't blame you. Now that I think about it, you're the self of short type, aren't you? Well, anyway, without that hair colours, what did you have in mind? Warm colours, we know what colour we need. Now, what kind of hair 
kid uh, does your true star hat. Lighthearted! Right, exactly. Well, that's exactly what I mean, sugar. So, without further ado, let me begin this phase of your transformation. This will take a moment, so please just hold still for a bit. Do 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 do! We get our original hairstyle back. Yep, indeed. Fine, you look fabulous, just like a style makes your eyes sparkle. With this new hairstyle, you'll be the toast of all dear sugar. No, but will just be the normal me. Oh, and here's your belongings back. Well, thank you very much for helping me get my, my hair and stuff. Oh, we'll visit the Able Sisters quickly as well, just seeing so if we've got anything inside. I won't be able to disable today, huh? Hey, welcome, welcome to the Able Sisters, where you are the fashion designer. And what have we got today? Also, I can't tell which glasses I've bought and which I haven't, but I always buy them anyway, just in case. Alright, we got a light blue cat for it. Yeah, I was worried about the winter gear because apparently that's stuff I need to buy. I think I may have said that already, but I also think I do need to make sure I've gone all of if we haven't already. Uh, optical shirt, buy. Thank you. Maybe it's even already gone because it feels like we're getting new shirts now. Which uh, I think I already have that, but oh well. And finally, a Daisy umbrella. I am Daisy. Okay, we can just sell these quickly. Do not hit the design button because we make that mistake often. I actually have room to spare. Yeah, don't sell the turban, but sell everything else. Sell, sell, sell! Boom. Okay, and that's a 307 bells? Yep, that's perfectly fine. Nope, that's all. Okay, how are you doing, Sable? Welcome, BFB. I'm so happy to decide to pay us a visit. I'm on Sunday, too. What? Who, me? Tee hee hee. I'm happy to see you at work, don't you know? Plus, I get to chit chat with our clients. Yeah, you always like a nice worker, like aren't you? Yes, indeed. I like working as hard as I can. Am I a worker? Like, um, I'm actually curious. What would you count? I guess you're a bit more carefree, but you have the carefree customers who, you know, help sort them out and stuff. It's not really about which job you do. It's about how good you are at a job and stuff to help others. Like, the, when I'm at my volunteer place, when I do till duty and stuff, it's more like. Hey, even though it's not as big a job as what the others are doing, it still helps out because it means no one else has to worry about till duty and stuff, and it helps out. But yeah. Anyway, I hope you two enjoy the rest of your day. Let's show off the items that we did get there. Great to see you. Come back soon, okay? Will do. Man. It's going to be so great when I can reorganize this room and stuff to be what I want it to be. Okay, for right now, we got room in here. We can also move stuff around again and get it back to how I like it. So, blop. Now we just go over here. Blip, blip, blip. And there we go. Okay, let's place down our gyroids first and let's see what they are. So, Mega Spot Toy to a Lullaboy. Is that a robot? Wow. This actually looks really cool. I like we've gotten spot doids, but we haven't got the complete ones, but that looks really cool. Wow. Yeah, get okay. well. For now, we're going to keep them stored up, or get Jess or Damien to get that done. Wait, why did I say Jess? This, this gal. Okay, otherwise, we got our present from Gladys, because she was at the house yesterday. Hello, BFB. I thought of this and thought it would really suit you. Please accept it. See you, Gladys. Guess what that's going to be? We also got a HRA reward that we've already seen. Yep, from when we got a letter from the HRA saying, Wow, you got this many points today. Stylish, elegant, sassy. You know what it is? This is a perfect room. And now we never have to listen to you ever again, oh, can't toss you. Well, we've just got a red letter just put in that slide as usual. Or oh, win it big is the password for tomorrow. So let's get our HRA stuff. And what did we get for Gladys? A man wall. I go up and turn that, but now we can place our mansion model! Look at it. So perfect, so pointless because you can't put it on a dumb table. But still, it looks really good, honestly. Very cute house. So I don't think these are technically worth the reward. The only reason you want to do it is for 100% completion, that's it. <laughs> like, you can't put it on this table. That's how awful this item is. Look at it. Look at the horrors that I can't place it on a table. A table, for goodness sake. Alright, we got items, so I'm just gonna... Well, I'll place the gyroids down just then. 
this gal can put them away later. And, uh, you know what? Actually, no, we can store our mansion house in the future area that uh, that'll be safely stored there. But anyways, yeah, let's go talk to everyone in town and stuff. Alright, I forgot about this. I was certainly complaining as Damien when I was wandering around, but I actually saw that black rose and stuff. I was like, oh cool, grow another black rose, yay! Because you cook ladders and freckles outside, there should be one more. Let's see, is it? Okay, Pinky's outside somewhere, so we're gonna run into work at some point. So all the boys are relaxing in their house today, it's the girls' day out! Alright, let's hunt down Pinky so we can give her a quick chat. There you are, Pinky. Oh, you're shocked as well. Hey, what's up, Emil Parky? He just want to tell you sort of the cute new nickname for you. Wait, hear it? Sure, give me something new. Okay, here's your new awesome nickname is Sunshine. Isn't that the coolest thing ever? Yep, it is. It's beautiful. Yep, that's right. Okay, friends, hooray for now. Your name's going to be Sunshine. I just know it'll make you super popular with people, Parky. Yay, nicknames! Please, just spread it freckles before you get overrun by Bee Monkey. I'll try my best. Okay, we need to have a quick chat, though. So we'll chat with you some more, right? Yeah, I like chatting with me too. All right, all right. You want something, didn't you, Barky? I'm here to talk and love that, that foul language. Now, Sancho, you go and help my wish, lifetime wish come to you. Yeah, I really need a fossil. Yep, yeah, a fossil. Sheesh. A fossil. Sheesh. Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. I accidentally solved them. Oh, what, really? Oh, Sorry, but it wasn't even singular fossils. I don't think so. It wouldn't help. No, I just have to give you one more chat. You called me Sunshine and stuff, and... Well, I can't achieve your dreams of fossils. You just have a quick chat. Hi, crushing Barky. All right, you want something, didn't you? Let's have a warm chit chat. Butch and Jay have the kind of friendship that only guys have. Yes, they do indeed. And they kind of really sell arguments with your fists. And it's just fun seeing them hang out and do stuff like boss connecting. It's really why I got interested in it. I don't know, maybe I could do something like a creepy decorations with my fossils and stuff. Ooh, that could actually be cool. You know what, if I get another fossil, I'll try to give it to you next time. Alright, we've visited everyone outside, so let's start off talking with Drake, who should be inside right now. Coming in, Drake! How's the Drake sir today? Oh, nothing, I'm just doing some moving around stuff and all that. Ah, I see, I can't bother you doing your winter cleaning. That's right. But don't worry, it'll be spring cleaning. We can call it a joke like that. Yeah! But okay, I'll go out now. See you later, bee monkey. Indeed. Well, from talking to one duck to another, how you doing, Bill? You got your nice bear shirts out of the well. How's life, bee monkey? And I scammed my elbow yesterday. I've been picking out the scab all dang day. Once I started, I just couldn't stop. I was now getting all the blood out of me. I was just so interesting seeing it. But you know for that. You got something to say to me? Quacko? Quacko, quacko? You're not irritating me with that. What's that handout look? You're looking for a handout, quacko? Right here, you can have this. My orange tie-dye. Filled with the blood of my latest victim. I find out lying around near body, but... Looks like you can still get some use from it. I can't believe what people don't take care about of stuff of that stuff. Oh, I'm rambling, but yeah. They should really not get murdered before they think they can get the stuff stolen. Yeah, totally not your fault, one, I think. That looks very nice, though. Yes, indeed. It's still covered in blood. Yep, and now I have to give myself a shower. Alright, you got anything else to say before I leave? I feel so good out tonight. I'm pumped, Quacko, so yeah. What do you need anyway, Quacko, Quacko? So, Bee Monkey, did you join the Happy Room Academy? I did, but I guess it's still too early for them to rate my room. Such as one of the members died. But I think the first thing I need to do is organize my weights. Because now, because they just barely survived. I was just so disappointed when one of them survived. Wait, one of them? Wait, what are you even saying? Oh, one died and then one got away barely with their life. I saw how got a nice kill count. I want to try to shoot shots from them, by the way. Ah, oh, great. Well, you know what? Do murder with them. Wait, really? You're really giving me permission to murder them? Yep, I think it'll be a great deal to society. I mean, we can just murder them. They'll get new employees that won't dirtly rank people's rooms. And it'll be fair and nice and won't disappoint villages and stuff. You'll be doing the world a service. Ow, I could do good stuff with murder? 
Wow, I never thought I could do that. That even crossed my mind. I don't care how murder more HRA people, especially since they're totally the ones that stole my fish. Are you sure you didn't get the evidence for Blood Evans Gladys? I'm still waiting on that, but I'm still hopeful that it is them. Are you for I'm still gonna murder them. Yes, the spirit, Bill. Anyway, I'll see you later, Bill. See you later, Bee Monkey. And how is Jay doing tonight? You doing good? Hey, you be my cat to visit me at this late hour. Man, I'm so flattered, Pump Metal. By the way, Pump Metal, what's going on with you today? Let's chit chat. I swear I got this bug about interior design, Lady Pump Metal. If I find any instruments, I'll buy them. But don't judge, Bee Monkey. If you find any instruments, come let me know with the quickness, Pump Metal. Yeah, why well, will I do? But let's have a normal conversation. You helped up night out. It's getting pretty dark out, but enough of that, You got something to say to me? Tell me anything. All right, it's on. I prepared a pop quiz just for you, Pump Metal. Well, we're getting lots of pop quizzes today. Which of my many bulging muscles, burly muscles, do you think is our my absolute favourite? I already said blow back, but hmm, glutes. Wrong, man. Too bad. The correct answer was each and every one of them. It wasn't quite fair. Yeah, I guess, sorry, that's the worst quiz ever. But hey, that's how I roll. And you might as well suck it up, Pump Metal. Wow. Yeah, I gotta do it. I love all my muscles. I gotta get training. They're perfect for using my instruments, digging up fossils. Oh man, there's so many uses. I don't know why people don't always build up their muscles. Because it takes so much work and effort, it's just very tiring and stuff. Yeah, but it's all worth it, right? Probably, but yeah. I think I would only want to do it just to use a better way. Oh man, you really don't want to just get more muscles. Yeah, I don't really like the look of too many muscles. And I just feel like, I uh, just like, you just need a little workout, just work out some flap and then that's it. Well, don't come crying to me when I get all the gals. Yeah, you got Yuka on yet? Yeah, I do. Well, right, I'm gonna see Butch, so I'll see you later. Say hi to Butch for me. Will do. No! What? How could you? Oh. I, I'm sorry, when I was moving stuff around, the fossils broke and stuff, and yeah. Okay, at least you didn't do it on purpose, I'm sorry, just... When I was moving stuff around, it just broke and fell apart, and I couldn't repair it. I'm sorry, don't worry. Need a hug? Yeah, thanks. Oh no, you're sick as well? Yeah, that, it really put me in a bad mood. You need medicine? Man, thank you, Barker, I mean it this time. Oh... Oh goodness. Oh man, I, I'm so sorry, but you have been having a rotten couple of days, haven't you? Yeah, but well, I feel better already. I guess it means I owe you one back here. Uh, Jay says hi, by the way. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, just not having a good time at all. Well, I think she's still got two other fossils. Yeah, I guess, but still. Sorry that I ruined all your progress with stuff like that. No, don't worry. Really just got you one day and that's all that matters. You're happy with that, right? Yeah, I guess. But, yeah. Okay, I definitely need to get you a bed, though. You'll do that for me? Yeah, because you need a place to sleep, but you can't just be lying on the floor. What's wrong with the floor? Huh? Lying on the floor is great. You can lie on the floor and have a nice nap. I mean, lying on the floor is very nice every once in a while, but still, you need an actual bed to rest. You can't just lie on the floor. That's not a good idea. But I'm feeling pretty good, actually, though. And that's all the thanks to BFB Medicine Bringer. Take care. Thanks, Barky. Now, take, take care now. Don't get catching cold like I do. I hope not. It would be very awful for recording to an Animal Crossing LP. But anyway, I'll let you recover and stuff, and I'll try to get you bed as well. Well, thanks for that as well. Anyway, I'll see you later. See you later, Bee Monkey. Well, here we are at the reef, and look at this. Just look at it. Just look at it all. Look how many turnips there are. Look at the gloriousness of it. A field of turnips. <laughs> as far as you can see. We. Oh yeah, I did a little turnip shopping. It totally didn't take any long hours. It totally only took like three hours of tire works just to get all these turnips bought and stuff. Just seeing how ridiculous it would take a long time to get. And this is only 8 million bell bells worth of turnips. And that's not even enough to get get a huge dent into it uh, if we get it for a good profit. Seriously, it's that expensive. See, look, 
Look at all the turnips, and that's only 8 million. If I sell it for, like, say, for 200 bells per turnip, that's only, like, 16 million. That's not even a dent into 99 million. That's how ridiculous that is. But, right, we're here because there's a point sale going on, so let's head inside. Of course, Tom Nook's probably not going to talk about that. It's just going to be like, oh, look, I'm Tom Nook. Yes, yes, what can I do for you and all that stuff, so... Yep, you can add in Jess, by the way. But alright, we're here to check out what's in the store today. Also, tip, if you run it in and out of the store, it'll crash the game, so yeah, don't do that. Alright, what's in here today? Well, I'm buying all of this anyway. Uh, it's actually new. I guess it is. But, oh no, Jess actually ran up. Come on, Jess, get up, please. We don't need a rupee instant now. Well, I haven't technically been buying all of this, but... Which would like this, I would say. Would he? Mm. Nah, I don't think you would. Actually. Well, we need to get him a bed immediately, so you know what? Buy this. Uh, you, yeah, I don't think he'll care either way. Well, he has modern stuff in his room, but yeah. Alright, well, I don't think there's anything I would want to give Freckles here because it's a lovely table, but yeah. I don't think. I really want to get a nice item, but I wouldn't want it to take over too much. But for right now, let's speed up and buy all these items that I'll have to sell and stuff. Okay, that's pretty much everything bought. We're just buying some extra medicine, so we can either shake a tree or heal butch. Which honestly, if we have the cat situation going on, we might have to, well, wait, we might have to interrupt butch being healed and stuff. But yeah, that's all for the last items. I'm keeping a copy of the Egyptian stuff, just, well, the Egyptian papers, just because then I can write a letter to butch and stuff, so then I can get his very, very bad. Otherwise, that's about it. No five bells, all that. Thank you, look at that. So we've been one hour of recording. And what is our platinum points here? Balance inquiry? Okay, well, we're nearing that, so I don't think I want to grind for it at this point because I'm just very tired. Which always happens. I always go like, yeah, I'm going to grind for it. Get tired. Oh, no, I don't want to grind for it now. But either way, I think with that, I'm going to cut to our own shops and then we can buy some stuff for freckles. So yeah, I'll see you later, Jess. Good luck with sell selling those turnips, because once we get a good price for them, we're going to be taking a while to sell them all. And that's even if we do get a good price for them. It could be a coin flip for right now, we just have a horrible week. But yeah, best wishes to both of us. Okay, Tom, look how you doing. Welcome, welcome. You're back now. Well, it's great to see you back. Where have you been? I went to the alternate universe review shop. Oh man, I'll take you for out some time. Yes, you will. All right, we'll get leave your evil deeds for right now, and we got to get some presents for freckles and stuff. So, right, I want to see what would I want to get freckles. I should also buy an instrument in case. I don't know. What's there instruments upstairs? I'll check in a bit. Right now, let's see. What would I want to get freckles? We can get a give her one of our paintings, maybe. Oh, fishing trophy. Maybe we could do that. Virgil would canonically have a fishing trophy in the house. Wouldn't that be good? I don't know if we could specifically give that. You know what? I'll give that a try. But we also want to give Freckles another present apart from that. So, let's see. What can we get? A rocking chair? No. Where should we? Kitty clock? No. Oh, Freckles doesn't have anything musical in that room, right? You know, what would be good? What would Freckles like with for music? Mm. Now, nah, okay, that's something I really would want to give her for music because they're not. I don't think any would fit her room because she has a wacky room and stuff, but. Okay, what else could we give her? Some. You know. Uh, I don't know, it's always hard to think of what I want to give her for because she has such nice random stuff which we could keep. Can we a teddy bear? Like, do we have a. Do we have a mama bear? Would that work? A uh, mama bear? Mm, what do I want to give her that though? Oh, look at me going back and forth and back and forth and back and forth and forth. 
Well, I guess all the instruments for we'll buy some more J. We don't find something there. We could give her a froggy chair. She'll totally like another froggy chair, right? The more froggy chairs, the better. Okay. No. We already gave her her, so no. Is that all the three poles, actually? Curious if that is. We didn't need to give her a gold. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. No, it's not pink. I was thinking it was going to be pink or something, but no. Cash register, coffee. It would be good for her. Well, maybe we could give her some night pieces. Well, yeah, we're gay now. We just need to get the last three, I think it is? Four, five. Yeah, blank on top of my head. Oh, what, Blina? Yeah, that sounds like something very cute for Freckles. Like, let me get on the big screen. Like, that has a nice cute wobble and stuff, and it would be very cute for a room. So, you know what? Oh, you know, let's buy that, and I'll see if there's anything else I would want to give up. Be nice to give us something nice. Are oh, you in the Wobblina? 630 bells, would you like to order it? Yeah, sure, but okay. Is there anything else I would want to get Freckles? You know, I'll check upstairs first, just so we've got any instrument that we need to get or not. And then we can decide from there. Okay, were there any instruments that I missed that I could give to Freckles? Anything amazing? Oh, no. You know what? Well, we're giving her the fishing trophy anyway, and we can just give her that. And yeah, I think it'll be enough. I, think. I don't want to alter her room too much when I think of it. So, for right now, I want to go catalog and we're going to buy one instrument for Jay and stuff. She's just going to get something we can give tomorrow. Alright, where's the instruments? Complex machine. I guess, like, past here, I think. So, if we go down, we should see instruments, right? Yeah. So, we've already given a folk guitar. Have we given them a folk guitar? It's always hard to remember which guitars I've given them. I don't want to give them a piano. Why are we now? Be a well loop. Up. Uh, well, I'll give her a folk guitar, I think. I don't know if it's one I've already given him, but... Sure, I'm sure he would like it, right? Adds more guitars to his collection. I see, I see. Yes, the folk guitar is very nice, very nice. For that delivery cash will be 1,440 bells. Would you like to order it? Order it? Yes, I will. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for your patronage. But the item will be in stock, so I can check your mail while regularly. But is there anything else you need help with? I don't know. But I think with that, I think that's it. I don't think we have anything else to do, really. So, yeah. Yeah, well, that's been nice. Actually, wait, we do need to mail the butch letter, actually. So, let me get that done quickly. Thank you very much. Please see us again soon, soon. Will do. Oh man. You can say something nice to me? Well, I hope your passions get reignited for good stuff. You don't have to worry about teaching people a lesson, even though you can talk more about it, but still. Make life easier for people, so they don't have to worry about all of that stuff, okay? I'll think about it. Probably not. Okay, you do you. Thanks so much. Please do come again. Hmm. Alright, got that letter all written up and stuff, so yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is when they put the town post office. What can they do for you? I need a mail letter quickly. So, yeah, let's get this all delivered to Butch. Here we go. To Butch. Sorry that you had to deal with the pain of your huge giant fossil breaking and you getting sick. Yeah, well, soon. So, here's a bed as well. From BFB. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the Robo bed and stuff. So, here we go. Thank you. But do you anything else? Nope. You just need to do... Do we want to empty it? Is there anything I would want to keep? Like, do we want to keep first? Yeah, nah. I think I'll just let them go and be recycled and stuff. Be used for other stuff. But with that, I think that's the end of today's episode. I may need to do a quick cut back if I accidentally find the key in Caitlyn, so... But otherwise, yeah. I think that'll be it for today's episode. Next time! It's Freckle's birthday! Plus an uh, extra something as well. So see you guys next time.